Okay, I'm reviewing the AccuMed. It's the Professional Fuel Cell Sensor Alcohol Breath Tester. And this is like the same one that uh, the police use, the same one that drug testing uh, agencies and stuff use. It comes with um, an instruction manual. It comes with the unit itself. I do not believe it had batteries. I think I had to get batteries. And it, has, and it comes with two mouthpieces on it. So what I'm going to do is I have uh, not had anything to drink today, so I'm going to test this and see how it, it shows up. And then just in the interest of science, I'm going to drink some booze for you guys. And then we will test it later and we will see what it reads. So you turn it on. It just says alcohol, I believe for alcohol. You press this for about a half a second and it's going to do a little test on the pH. And then it'll come up and it'll say test. And then you're going to blow through it for about six seconds. Okay, so here I go. All right, so now it is analyzing it. And there it is, 0, 0.000, which it should be because I've not had any drinks. So uh, I'm going to check back a few hours later this evening after a couple of beers or something like that. And we're going to see what it says. All right, thanks. Okay, so as promised, uh, I went ahead and uh, had a couple of beers when I was in the jacuzzi. I mean, the jacuzzi wasn't part of the deal, but that was just a bonus for me. Okay, wait, here we go. And I need to go pick up my wife, who is uh, a couple of miles away from here. So let's see if I can, legally. No, no, there's a text message. So I am 0 .06, now that was two beers and about a quarter to a half of a margarita that was left over from last night sitting in the refrigerator. But that was over about an hour period of time, so they were fairly close together. And that actually is still legal in California, so I can legally drive. Now they do say to do this twice, um, just to make sure. So I'm going to go ahead and run this through one more time. And no one tell my wife that I did this prior to picking her up. All right. And 0.064. So they were pretty pretty close to each other. So you, I could probably figure I'm definitely a 0 0.060, 0 0.062, something like that. Um, but that is within the legal limit, you know. So uh, it, you know, it's interesting because I do know that I have a little buzz in my head, and I really have no idea whether I'm actually uh, legal to drive right now uh, without this. And um, well, it's probably not the smartest idea because it is 0.06. Um, it's still legal though, so uh, it, it's something that if you're out in a restaurant, bar, or whatever else, and you've had a few drinks and you really want to know before you get in your car, um, it's something that would be really, really good to have around. And it seems to be pretty darn accurate, and you can use it over and over again. Some stores, we, we gave one of these as a gift, not this one, it was another one. It could only be used, I don't know if it was 20 or 50 times, and then it ran out and you threw it away and you started over again. This one can be used over and over and over again. So. Uh, excellent product, uh, really something you should have if you go out and recreationally drink or head to the bars or something and you really want to know whether you should be driving or not, I really recommend it. Thanks for watching.